the orange one here. We're gonna try and just take the city. I don't know how this is gonna work. I don't know if it will work. Um, I think I'll, I'm gonna try and take the city, maybe drop a couple units out of my army, and try and make a run for the city, and see if that will work. I don't think it will, but we're kind of out of options, so we're going for it. That's That's the plan. It might be a terrible plan. It probably is a terrible plan. Um, honestly, with the walls busted like they are, I don't know how we're gonna really be able to defend things. Wait, hold on, what? Oh, this wall isn't busted here. Oh, okay, so this side's intact. There's that side over there that's busted up. Okay, well, um, looks like no one's going for this. Yeah, I'm gonna go uh, Lone Range over here. You know, climbing with my two legs, like a boss. Oh, oh, never mind. Not, not gonna do that. There's a lot of them right there. So maybe, maybe I'm distracting them though. <laughs> yeah, that was insane. I gotta say that is totally unrealistic. How my character just like can climb up and down those stairs, taking arrows with a shield. You know, and just be like totally bounce real nicely. Hello, guys. I hide behind the cart. Don't mind me. At least we have siege equipment, right? That should be firing on them. Are we inside the walls? I feel like we're inside walls. I mean, look at how many kills we're getting. That can't just be nothing right I think they're trying to defend that point over there for some reason they're saying a lot of people over there fine buddy looks like we've got is the door open I think the door's open yeah it looks like we've basically taken the castle they're trying to defend up there it looks like cool a terrible idea but you know all the power more power to you I guess Yeah, I take a couple shots. I like, can't even really see what I'm aiming at. But I figured we're hitting things, so might as well. Man. Okay. Is that. Uh, are those my guys? Those might be my guys. Maybe I should stop shooting. Yeah, those are my guys. Yeah, it's game over for this castle and town. Which is, again, this is not a town. When I look at this, this is a video game city. Like, look at that. That's not a town. Come on. It's a city, dude. The town's, like, got, like, one pub. This place at least has, like, three or four. Like, IRL, if you were to look at a place like this big, right? That city, that's actually a really cool city in the back. I like that look a lot. That's really, really unique. Okay, there's gotta just be a few of them left. 11, 10, okay. It's not. No, those are my guys. We'll just do our amazing ladder climbing right here. <laughs> okay, there we go. That's good. Uh, let's see if we can pull this off. I don't think we will be able to. I am not going to get prisoners because that will just slow me down. And I'm looking to be quick right now. Quicker than I think we're really going to be able to be, to be honest. Um, the loot, we're so light right now. Okay, so check this out. They're going to probably catch us. Unless I do something like, hey, good luck. Yep, can I? Oh, yeah, it looks like they're fighting him. These guys are still on my. Oh man, this is not good. I don't think I'm going to be able to get in there. Um, Can I dump like another dude, like that guy? 
Yeah. Cool. I'm I'm good. I am golden. <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> that was pretty messed up, and that's like pretty exploitative. But you gotta do what you gotta do. You guys, if you're like a day away, come come to me. We need it. I mean, I'm pretty sure they're gonna leave. When they're done here, but maybe not. Nah, actually, you guys, you're fine. You don't need to come to me. Um, I know that's a waste of influence, but I have so much, it's not a big deal. Honestly. Okay, so we got Hudson Folk. I think probably our best use of resources is continue to harass that um, army that's kind of wandering around. Flash, uh, trying to maybe, maybe even go on the offense. I don't know. I mean, they're gonna take some folk. I'm pretty sure, Dynastica, because they're they don't have many defenders, as you can see. Okay, yeah, we're gonna have to stay here for a while. Oh, uh, what's the? Uh... Oh, making peace. Could I make peace with them? Okay. All right. Yeah. I guess we'll do peacetime episode. <laughs> so the game wants. I wonder if I didn't need to sacrifice those lords. <laughs> uh, guys, I'm gonna actually disband the whole army, including my guys, because they, they need to go get more troops. I'm just gonna stay here so that I myself can uh, kind of repopulate the garrison. Uh. Who's this gonna go to? Yeah, you guys lost your the Oranta guard that I took, huh? That's a that's a shame. Well, at least we got these these cities down here. Feeling pretty good about that. We really just need to make sure that the Kuzay don't get stronger. That's essentially my goal. <laughs> um, so let's kind of stop waiting. Actually, and actually, can I? I said I wanted to donate troops. So if I've got any like crummy troops, I don't have too many of them. If I have any, yeah, recruits, I don't need those. Watchmen, yeah. Any, uh, anything that's a two or one that's not a Kuz eight unit can go. Um, and then we're just gonna kind of try and recuperate my units, and uh, hopefully my my lords take care of some looters and uh, help the economy recover a little bit. I just kind of want to go around here and see if I can build some relation with uh, lords. That's kind of what I'm thinking. Odrasa, is that? That's not what... Oh man, I'm so bummed I lost that. Maybe Emprela will have some of the units I'm looking for. I think they, they might be Sturgeon, though. I could search it. That is something that is definitely a distinct option for us. Okay. Um, okay. I bet these are Imperial units. Yep. I thought. Okay. The good news is that my my guys should kind of spread out and get a ton of units. Oh man, that's, that's a shame. Uh, can I catch the looters? They seem to be moving pretty slow there. You can go, just give me a second, I need to upgrade my troops. Because the I think there's the possibility that they'll actually join me. Whoa, that was weird. I think I was a little too quick on my button pressing. Yeah, I think in the times of peace, it is always worthwhile to try and do some quests and take care of a little bit of your economy, you know? That was, attack! uh, that was me telling you guys to attack. <laughs> <laughs> I almost want to get my cavalry more experience, and specifically my Kuzay units, just to level them up. I don't, I don't really have a place to garrison up the rest of them over here, which is a shame. 
because having a place to get build a garrison is really nice. That's really at this point in the game. But all that's like in land in land right now. I haven't been a gotten uh, anything for myself in a while, you know. Maybe I'll, I'll let the NPCs get the last of the kills, get some more experience with them. I need to stop taking kills away from my units at this point because I don't think I'm getting any better at fighting. You know, character-wise, stats-wise, kind of like a waste. Unless it's like gonna save lives, it's a waste for me to get involved in like the little battles. You know, I'll oh, check that out. More horse archers. Okay, looks good to me. Got some special units we need to get rid of from our prisoner pool, but we'll get to that. Okay, that's raided. Is this also? I, I've got a feeling that all of these are raided. Yeah. Dang it. Okay, um. Um, Prela, if I look at that. Prela is. Is there anything to indicate its ethnicity at all? Let's go up there. We'll make our way up that away. Hamshar, that sounds like Kashmir. <laughs> Doesn't it? I, I like almost read it out loud that way. You know, I think that we'll um maybe go to war with these guys soon. Well, there was a uh, there was someone that was uh, um willing to give us a recruit. That's kind of nice. Yeah, I need to work on relations with these people if they let me. doesn't look like they're gonna really let me. But yeah, I think um, our, my armies were kind of hurting. It's something that I also need to consider. Is that um, our troops needed to rest and collect. Because we have, all, like, uh, oh, wait, hold on, what? I'm out of food. Well, let's go get some grain then. I'll just like take all your grain, honestly. Actually, I'll take all of your food. Thank you. Don't starve. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, it's kind of insane how uh, you just kind of roll through and just like buy so much food from these places. And then, like, honestly, it doesn't even last that long. Oh, I didn't even check to see if they had units for me. I don't have an awful lot, unfortunately. If this is Imperial or Sturgeon, I'm gonna be sad, but I feel like it will be. I think we need to, like, kind of reinforce the cities that we've acquired and then push further in. Maybe... I don't know, are the... Other kingdoms at war, like if I go to the, um, you got war, yeah, you're at war with us, sorry, so maybe I'll let you guys, like, punch each other a little while. Oh man, these places are imperial, it's a shame. I mean, I'm pretty like... It's kind of hard to say what it sounds like because it's like all fictional, right? And you never hear anyone say any of the names of the places because Bandlord doesn't have spoken dialogue. Which I hope they, you know, I saw that they did have that a little bit in the game, and I hope that they don't try and do that too much because it just makes it the dialogue so limited, you know, like what we saw with the Fallout series. Um, okay, let's see. I kind of feel like trying to convince a lord to join us. Let's, let's try and find um, some lords. Bolasia. 
Oh no, I crashed the game. Okay. That's a shame. Okay. Off to try and figure out where we were. Okay, so we have a bit of a situation here. We got a large amount of um, Guse units that are around my Zaya. They just took it from the Sari. And I want to um, go to war with these guys. And I think that we have a pretty good situation here. Um, we've got like 400-ish, some 500-ish something troops. They've got one, two, three, four, four hundred-ish, like in the immediate vicinity. So we have an opportunity to wipe out all these lords. And then we can uh, work on actually sieging Mysia. So I think that we have a really nice opportunity to do that right now. So we should just do it, you know? So, uh, yeah, let's just do it. Hello. I to deliver my dance. Dance? I've got to do a dance off. Um, yeah, it's pretty much a one on one battle. Not ideal. Seeing how there's that city that's also right there, it's pretty much undefended. And I have other lords that aren't too far away. I told them to come to me. I think that this is, is the right move. I mean, we're going to have some move, casualties. Move! Infantry! Move! Cavalry! Follow! Horse! Follow At me. this point, we generate more troops than they do. We just need to use them intelligently. Like, if we have a a one-on-one -on -one battle, and we win, that's still good for the war. Previously, that was not always the case. Honestly, it was not. <laughs> uh, but now it is. So, great. Um, let's get our cav kind of like here. Kind of loop them in front of our arches a little bit. Try and distract. Try and turn them. Their arches. Get some shots, maybe. One archers. Can you hit them, please? Yes. Okay, we're kind of hitting them. That's good. There's a whole lot of them, though. I need to be careful because they could just start taking shots at us. We just need to be kind of pursuing them. It's my cav. Just making sure that, yeah, they are following. Cool. They just have so many right now, honestly. This is just an insane amount of troops that we're dealing with. Oh god. I'm not trying to. Can we please just get on them? Yeah, come on, horsemen. Let's get in there. I believe in you. Let's like charge through a little bit. Yep. Okay, kind of have them trapped. They're going through my infantry. Oh. Well, not trapped, but you know what I mean. Oh, hello. Oh, come on. Aw. Oh. There we go. Just need to hit them hard. Oh, I think I just hit one of my own guys there. Pretty sure. Okay, well, their... Ar the horse archers here are pretty... Pretty hurt. Definitely not doing as well as they were. Okay. Um. And look at that. Look at that. If we look at our kill to death ratio during that. It's pretty good. Like horse archers, effectively neutralized. Not completely, but effectively. Pretty happy with it. Okay. There we go. Ah, uh, oh man. See, once you start rolling with your own horse archers, and you also have, like, archers on the ground that aren't idiots, you can do some pretty amazing stuff. Are they coming towards me or what? What's the deal here? Who are you shooting at? Are you shooting that far, really? You have bows that can go... 500 from here. I kind of have that kind of hard to believe. Everyone follow me. Yeah, everyone, we can start going for it a little bit. I think that we have... They're not going to get reinforcements, I'm pretty sure. 
We just need to make sure that we don't lose the high ground. Because they do have enough. It's essentially still a one to one battle. Yeah. I've killed more than they have, but not by a whole lot. Not, not by a whole lot. Let's get to a distance where we can actually do some damage with some arrows. Okay, this should be where we're, things are actually interesting. We got our actual arches. Yeah, go to the open field here. I mean, this looks like it's basically flat. You know, it's basically level with what's over there. I'm okay with level. I would like the high point over here, though. Yeah, sorry, bear with me. I mean, a one-to-one -one battle if we win it is fine. But if we can not charge people down a hill or make them charge up a hill at us, that would be how I'd like. I think, yeah, like right here is pretty dang good. They're gonna have to advance on us right here. I say, like, hey, I'm gonna blow go there. I think they're already advancing, to be honest. I'm not sure. They might not be. Kinda hard to say. I think they're kind of like scattered a little bit. Well, let's just pelt them. Honestly. If our archers just kind of like fire into that crowd. It's not a bad move. Maybe if I could get my horse archers a better angle. I don't know. There's a whole lot of cab right there. This is making me a little nervous. How much do I have? Them? I mean, we got about as many as they have. Truth be told. You guys are shooting, right? Yeah, you are. We do have some trees between us. Let's just loop our cavalry behind them. That sometimes when you flank them, it kind of moves them forward a little bit. They don't like being flanked. Naturally. Let's see. Can we kind of bait you in? I mean, I'm fine with shooting at your cavalry too. That's cool with me. Yeah, come at me. Come on, come on. Do it. Here we go. I really should be not going this way, it's kind of dumb, because I can't shoot them from this side. I kind of would like our archers to be able to shoot at them, if they're gonna be charging us. You know, oh, well there goes one of my horsemen. Archers, can we get some cover, please? Thank you. Was that dude? That's one of their, their dudes right there. Horsemen, you can kind of loop left now and then we should be able to get some horse searches shooting okay hello oh geez i did not see that oh god oh. Oh. horse searches to charge and cavalry should be charging too I should be probably trying to make my way over to the front line though. I can. I mean, my cavalry is actually destroying theirs right now. Pretty nice. Pretty nice work there. I mean, they're not destroying them actually. They're it's kind of. Oh, geez, that could have been me. Hello. Uh oh. Yep. That dude's got his eye on me. I'm pretty much at the line though. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm good. I'm fine. Kill him, kill him. I do have six arrows. Keep that in mind. Um, let's see, that guy. These guys are just getting annoying.
Are they really just holding their ground over there? Okay. Get our guys back here a little bit. Our horse archers got... Ooh, man, they got pretty badly t taken out. It's, uh... Be a little bit more defensive then. Archers, can you just get a little bit up there? A little bit closer. Hey, yep. I think we might have just been a little bit too far out. We might have just been a little bit out of their range, their effective range. I don't know. No, they're still, still shooting. We're still getting some kills. Good. I mean, if we're looking at things now, it is definitely showing us with a clear advantage in terms of kills. We've got about two to one kills. Oh man, this is taking a lot longer than I thought it would go. Two to one is a nice ratio though. I mean, we're getting, yeah, that was one of our footman archers. I'm just, just trying to keep an eye to see if they're actually getting any kills. They are. They definitely are. Maybe if it's tell the archers to move up, I don't know. Maybe footman first. We have the footman to move up into this hill. I just kind of want to push into them at this point. Okay, archers you can come to. Our cavalry already have this hill, so the thing is, if they try and move on us, we can always charge our cavalry down. You know? Okay. Pretty good. We should definitely get more kills now. We've got a lot of dis distance between us, so we should be able to get a lot more. Okay, yeah, this is that's more. That is okay. Here we go. Yeah, we were just a little too far away. It looks like. Pull back a little bit. That was very nice seeing that. We'll just kind of like continue hitting them, right? Yeah, perfect. Take it. See, this is gonna be kind of rough. Oh, nope, they're falling back. Wow, they're dumb. You do that a few times, our archers are gonna have to pick them clean. Infantry, come help. Maybe don't charge. Yeah, that was dumb, Paul. Charging. in. Yeah, I don't quite charge in. We don't need a charge in just quite yet. I mean, do we have more arrows? It looks like we do. I think they... They must have arrows, too. I don't know if they've been holding onto them or if they're out. I mean, at the very least, their shields have to be getting damaged, right? <laughs> this is kind of crazy that they're just sit sitting there. Because, like, it's only going to get worse for them. Like, you know, like, there's no way that this can get better. This is definitely, I feel, a little like, cheesy here. A little exploitative. I mean, if the game's gonna let me do it, I'm gonna let it happen, you know? It's funny how dramatic the music is, and then we're just kinda like, whittling these guys down. Oop, there goes something thrown back at us. I don't know what on earth the AI is trying to do, but... Oh, there's the javelin. There's another one. Oh, they're starting to throw some javelins. 
Are they actually closer to us? Tell you what, I'm gonna just let the uh, sergeants take over and see what they do. I'm just curious. Yeah, it looks like they were just charging in. We have such a numbers advantage. It kind of doesn't make sense to hold back. Though I would like a tighter formation. This should work just fine. Okay, let's see if I can get in there. Not with cavalry though. Oh, I got five damage on one dude. <laughs> okay, fifty damage. That's good. Okay, yeah, we're definitely having some losses, but I think they're they're getting a lot more. Yeah, this is this is good. This is what we want. This should end it. Okay. Um. Oh. Oh. oh, I just stabbed that dude that's on the horse there for 44 damage. Nice. That was I. I have to really say that's just luck. More than anything else. Okay, that guy's down. <laughs> I don't know if this is gonna even kill the dude. Nice, okay, dude. Uh, that's that's gotta be it though, basically, right? And just there's a bunch of them running away, but they're either gonna die or get uh, captured, probably. I don't know. Let's see. Um, I think though this combined with the earlier bit should be about half an hour long. I apologize, I was hoping to actually take my Isaiah as well in this episode, but I guess not. But at least we uh, we won a battle against them in an advantageous position, and we've had more cities getting reinforced that we've taken recently. So I think that we're definitely in a better position. I don't know about them, because they're having to fight the Sari as well as myself. But if you look at our combined forces, they're dealing with a lot. The problem is that Asari and I keep on, you know, going to war against each other. And in those cases, I almost unilaterally just demolish them. It's really against these guys that I have issues. That was a good battle, though, for us. A very good battle. I mean, it wasn't like we took out a huge amount of their armies. We only took out, like, 500, and they've got, like, what... Um... Is it 3,000-ish or something? There's some skirmishes. I want to increase my, my archers. As you can see, that's been that's proven to be very effective. These guys are better as footmen, though. Okay. Uh, how many prisoners can I take? I can't take. I have to give. It's a shame. Let's actually get some uh, useful ones then. AKA who's eight raiders <laughs> and horsemen. Oh man, that's a nuts uh, haul right there, honestly. I can get also these tribal warriors. Um, any other horsemen? Yes. Man. Okay, we we have some really good recruits that we just picked up there. Get rid of the looters and the other like terrible units that we just don't need or want. Um Yeah, we're getting closer. I think that's good, yeah. Okay. Let's just kind of see after the battle. I, I just kind of want you guys to be able to see kind of what we're dealing with. Okay, so we got that. Got this here. They got even more people in there. That's fine. I've got tons of people on the way. So I think that we'll be okay. But we'll see. Uh, I, I don't really know. This place has recently uh, been taken. It looks like the walls are intact, though. So, yeah. 
We'll see. Um, we, oh look, there's Belgir, Grindor, and Ekron. So if I look at those, I'm just...